Are you part of a nonprofit organization, a youth group looking to raise cash for your cause? Stay tuned at the end of this video to learn how you can bring the action and excitement of the Millennium Wrestling Federation to your town live, featuring the superstars and legends of yesterday, today, and tomorrow. This is Mick Foley. This is Harley Race. This is Shelton Benjamin. This is Mr. Wonderful Paul Orndorff. This is the Monster Abyss. And this is Daniel Bryan. This is JBL, and you're watching the MWF. Be there live. Wrestling fans from around the corner and around the world, welcome to another installment of Wrestling Insiders. Live from MWF Studios just north of Boston in downtown Melrose, Mass, the zip code of champions 02176. Stay tuned after this video for great deals where you can support indie wrestling. Another big news item coming out of WrestleMania weekend is the return of the Hardy Boys to WWE. They were a surprise addition to the Raw Tag Team title ladder match Sunday in Orlando, defeating Gallows and Anderson, Sheamus and Cesaro, and Enzo and Cass to win the titles. Just a month ago, the Broken Hardys were the reigning and defending Impact Wrestling Tag Team champions. They were unable to come to terms on a new contract, and bad blood developed over who owned the rights to the Broken Hardys' characters. Uh, the Hardys made several appearances in Ring of Honor, winning and losing their tag team titles from and back to the Young Bucks Saturday night in Lakeland, Florida. WrestleMania hosts The New Day made the announcement just before the ladder match was to get underway. I'm not sure how it came across on television, but the eruption from the fans at Camping World Stadium Live was huge. As I predicted weeks ago in various videos we produced, the Hardys, they competed at WrestleMania with the Hardys WWE fans knew and loved. The Broken Hardys may have had a cult following and fun to see once or twice, but long term, big picture, it's childish nonsense, almost like Matt and Jeff were dressing up for Halloween. That's not going to make WWE the most money, and it's not going to make the Hardys the most money. The presentation we saw at WrestleMania and on Raw the next night is what's quote-unquote best for business. will be interesting to see how the Hardys are used going forward. With the Hardys' personal struggles in the past, it was felt a light schedule as they had in TNA would be better for them rather than the full-time WWE uh, road schedule. Perhaps there was some common ground found when they negotiated their contracts. When Jeff left WWE in 2009, he was offered a deal that was described to me as one that The Undertaker couldn't get due to the giant success of Jeff's merchandise sales. There are obviously many dream match scenarios for Jeff in the singles ranks on both Raw and SmackDown beyond the Hardy Boys as a tag team. Fans, what do you think of the Hardy's return? Would you like to see them as a tag team or compete in singles matches? Share your thoughts in the comment section below. 2017 is here and that means WrestleMania season is here. Now's the time to get WWE Network for one month free. Check out the 30th Royal Rumble at the Alamo Dome, plus the return of Elimination Chamber, Fast Lane, two NXT TakeOver specials, the WWE Hall of Fame, all accumulating with the granddaddy of them all, WrestleMania 33 at Camping World Stadium in Orlando, Florida. Use the link below and start watching all the great action in, in history of WWE today. Visit the MWF store this month for a huge sale. We're spending $25 or more, you get both a free WWE t-shirt and a free autographed photo of Cowboy Bob Orton. We have brand new WWE merchandise, t-shirts, autographs, DVDs, action figures, books, and tons more. Best of all, every dollar spent goes to supporting our live event and video initiatives. Now fans in over 30 countries can rent or own our Studio Shoot Interview DVD library digitally starting at only $5.99. Check out the world famous Iron Sheik Studio Shoot that's been seen by millions online and the Howard Stern Show, an in-depth 1980s WrestleMania 1 roundtable, plus individual studio shoots with the late Paul Bearer, the Boogeyman, the Ugandan Giant Kamala, a look at WWE NXT with Bull Dempsey, and more. Don't settle for cheap imitations. Watch the best now using the links below. Subscribe to our YouTube channel with over 1,400 free videos. From live MWF wrestling to studio shoot interviews, history, news, and more. Help support the cause by donating an amount of money of any size using paypal.me slash bostonwrestling. You can also help the cause using our links to a variety of popular online stores including WWE Shop, Amazon, and Walmart. We get a small thank you for every customer sent their way, and best of all, it doesn't cost you an extra penny on any purchase made. Finally, get a free ride from us on Uber. Get a ride in any city Uber services up to $20 using the links below. Forget about overpriced taxi cabs with long waits. Use 2017 technology to get a clean ride and great driver and even better price now using the links below. Running out of time here, fans. Don't miss a day on bostonwrestling.com. Like us at facebook.com slash mwfaction. Follow us at mwf2001. 
subscribe to us at youtube.com slash Boston Wrestling Kong. Until we speak again, be well. The Millennium Wrestling Federation's 15th anniversary tour begins this fall and rolls into 2017 throughout New England, down the East Coast, and into the Carolinas. If your nonprofit organization is looking for an interactive, turnkey experience while putting the fun into fundraising, you've met the perfect tag team partner. MWF offers a variety of packages for groups of almost any size. From our live events at the Boston Garden, the Kowloon Entertainment Dining Complex, and the legendary Suffolk Downs, to high school gyms and function halls, we've presented live events everywhere. Since 2001, the MWF's mission has been simple, keep the kids off the streets. Under the leadership of President Dr. David Reese, we bring the superstars of yesterday, today, and tomorrow to your town, not for a quote-unquote wrestling show, but an event that features action-packed in-ring wrestling, autograph and pose photo opportunities, question and answer sessions, and much more. It is the best of sports and entertainment. The week of your event, we can add on to the endeavor with anti-bullying campaigns, library meet and reads, youth sport concussion seminars, and more. Our live events are fit for fans of every age, from 5 to 95. This fall is part of our new Kids Club program. We offer live event experiences exclusively for the youngest of fans. On the flip side, we can also produce a tailor-made event for fans of an older demographic as well. We work with you every single step of the way to get the word out to fans near and far, on our local television offerings, and to over 50,000 fans and growing on our social media platform. Your success is our success. If your group has had enough of boring candy bar and wrapping paper sales and has the energy to team with our passionate fan base, bringing the MWF experience to your community is the answer to put smiles on faces while raising cash for your cause. Contact us today to get the ball rolling for your custom-made event that you want to bring back year after year. Don't just take it from us. Here are folks we've teamed with in the past. Smackdown Live and the fallout from WrestleMania so you can hashtag best night of my life with non-stop action in the moments of elite new wrestling. Plus all your favorite superstars, no filter. It's WWE Smackdown Live on Tuesday, April 11th. Tickets and ringsetter packages are available Friday, February 17th at 10 a.m. You already know Kowloon Restaurant, established in 1950 and spanning four generations, serves a multi-Asian menu. Did you also know that Kowloon Restaurant is New England's premier Asian dining and entertainment complex, serving Cantonese, Szechuan, Thai, and Polynesian cuisine? And did you know that Kowloon Restaurant is also the home of the finest Japanese sushi? If you haven't dined at Kowloon Restaurant lately, then you simply haven't dined at Kowloon. Kowloon Restaurant, Route 1 North in Saugus.